I'm Nate, this is Shootfish Productions and today's video is a bit of a remake on a video we've previously done on these things, silencers, suppressors, whatever you want to call them. Moderators. Moderators, yeah, thank you guys. Uh, got to get the terminology right these days. <laughs> you get in trouble, I don't know why, uh, but there you go. So, keep watching and uh, you'll find out what happened. On the previous video we've done on suppressors, we'll call them uh, for the purpose of this video. On the previous video we've done on suppressors, um, we were shooting at targets, and a lot of the viewers pointed out that that actually interfered with uh, what is it, you know you get all the noise from the pallet in the target. So we're going to totally redo the video. We're going to use multiple microphones, hopefully make it better and make a. Because when you see decibel numbers, that don't really mean anything to you. And I think like hair and are recorded as best we can on different microphones in different positions. Might give you a better feel for what it actually sounds like in the field or using it yourself when you're concerned about your neighbours or you just, you know, want to get it as quiet as you can or whatever. So uh, keep watching and um, you'll find out what happened. So we're going to test uh, two rifles. We're going to test three, but my Webley Raider is here, it's in bits. I've uh, got a problem with the what I think is the hammer spring, so I might do a separate video on that. So we're going to do two rifles, two pistols, and one of them pistols has got a 3D printed suppressor. So I think that's very interesting, so um, let's get on with it. Right, I'll just give you a little tour of the uh, what the setup we've got here. There's Daz, he's got a marker on the floor. Keep the distance about the same on this chair, pretty close to me. We've got an iPhone 6, and we'll go up to where we've got a lot of the stuff. I'll zoom in on that. We've got a little digital recorder there on the front. And if I scroll around, somewhere over there, there's a mono digital recorder there, and they're quite good quality. Uh, and the, the camera's sounding very good. Um, oh, I've got this voice recorder next to it. Oh yeah, right, there's the pot propped up on a dumbbell. It's just marked with a few sort of weeds growing on it. And we've got Daz, you know, probably three, four foot away, Daz. Yeah, probably. About yeah, that. so um, what I'll do, I'm going to keep the camera pointed in exactly the same position. So we've got to run about. We basically do every gun we've got. Unsilenced, then silenced, and then hopefully through editing yeah. we could try yeah. and get we're not real sound across. Yeah. We're not going to babble too much because no. that keep raining. We've got to get this done. So <laughs> yeah. what we'll do, we'll t we'll say what what gun it is without a suppressor, so the voice recorders yeah. know what's going on as well. Daz, remember that you, you're telling the voice recorders what's happening, yeah. not the camera. Right, we've got the Air Arms S400. Uh, this is unsuppressed, so we'll load one in. With suppressor, air arms, S4 TEDF. This is the PP700W 22.22 caliber unsuppressed. Now, what we're going to do. Right, we have here is the Crossman 1077 CO2 semi auto, uh, what is it, 177? Yep. 177 rifle, uh, yeah. Give it a bang. It's got, oh, it's got a brand new gas tank in it. Oh, it's got a brand new gas tank, so you'll probably hear the gas more than the actual fire. But. Give a couple of shots there as soon as you got, you know. Shot two, shot three, unsuppressed. Bang, there we go. Crossman 1077 suppressed. Shot three, unsuppressed. You can notice it quite a lot, yeah, actually. Sound, literally sounds like your gas tank is running out. Yeah. Right, now we've got the HW40 PCA. 
Um, so we're going to try this, and then we're going to actually do the 3D printed uh, silencer we made in a previous video for. But I've been using it, and we got out tonight, and Dad has yeah. noticed the end had been shot out, so I obviously didn't Just have it in the right. I didn't know it was a pellet flying off. But we could make... We're, we're going to test it anyway, yeah. just for the hell of it. So, does it... Uh, Auto safety, yeah, it's quite annoying, but you need it, because that triggers, so... Right, so we've got the HW40, unsuppressed, first shot. What are the other two shots? That's quite loud. Press shot two. That worked anyway. We you snap your t-shirt. No, you didn't see nothing. Like it. You didn't see it a thing. <laughs> so press shot number one. Shot. First shot. First shot. Well, thanks again for watching another one of our videos, and uh, I hope this is a lot better than our original silencer video where I was hitting solid metal targets with metal pallets. So, all you heard was a lot of tinging. Yeah, um, so. But yeah, this was a fun video. We tried several times to get this one done. Um, weather just wanted to kick us in the ass every time. So, uh, Even this wind watching. is probably going to interfere yeah. with the mics yeah. and the audio. You, so that's going to be horrible. That's like jinxed. Ever. Jinxed days, mate. Um, every video is with you, isn't it, mate? Yeah. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. We really appreciate it. And uh, stay tuned for our next one.